Have you ever wondered what makes a good Fender? We endorse a holistic approach to Fender system design, where three crucial elements are allocated equally. Project conditions, components and design, as well as manufacturing. Today, we take a closer look at the Fender production process. Natural rubber is sourced from the Para rubber tree in Southeast Asia, but we've established strong partnerships with local suppliers to reduce our environmental footprint. The region is also home to our manufacturing facility. Introducing Shibata Fender Team, where high-performance fenders are born Our journey begins with the compounding, the first major step of achieving high-performance fenders. Rubber compound is made from a blend of natural and synthetic rubber, fillers, and other additives. At the Banbury Mixer, our rubber compounding process unfolds. Feeding masticated natural rubber and synthetic rubber into the mixing chamber to forge a homogeneous rubber blend. The subsequent addition of carbon black and processed oil enhances durability and strength. We now move on to the rolling mill, just below the Banbury mixer. Here, the compound is transformed into sheets which are dipped in a diluted anti-tack solution to prevent them from sticking together. Then, they are transferred to a cooling chamber to reduce temperature and dry. Finally, the cooled down sheets are cut into the desired lengths using a rotary cutter. The final stage of the mixing process takes place in the kneader. Sulfur is added to the master batch to enhance hardness and elasticity. Maintaining the right temperature during all time is of crucial importance. The same series of steps are repeated in a rolling mill beneath the kneader, including embossing for traceability. At the end, we cut a piece from the master batch for testing purposes. Before manufacturing and curing, also known as vulcanization, we examine the compound and determine the perfect curing conditions for each batch. We use the same sample for physical properties testing to verify the compound meets all required standards. Only once all requirements are fulfilled, the master batch is approved and can be used for production. The TGA test of the master batch grants the traceability of the compound and finished product. Manufacturing is the process of shaping rubber sheets into fenders. The most common manufacturing process to create high-performance fenders is injecting rubber compound into a mold. Then comes curing in autoclaves, where rubber changes from a plastic to an elastic state. Precise temperature and pressure control are key in the autoclave to ensure consistent top quality products. For large fenders, we use jacket molds with steam circulation during curing for even heat distribution. Their unique design allows for steam circulation through the double outer walls to heat up the rubber to the precise curing temperature. After a certain time in the temperature stabilization room, fenders will be moved for performance testing. The fender is placed in a large test press, compressing it to its design deflection while measuring the reaction force using load cells and pressure transducers. At this stage, the fender undergoes a comprehensive visual examination to ensure its appearance is flawless, free from cracks or defects. QAQC is accurately verifying the dimensions and ensure they fall within the manufacturer's specified tolerance. A small piece of rubber is cut from the finished product and sent to the laboratory for a TGA test. Based on its results, it can be verified that the fender was made from the original tested compound. The production trip is over, 
and our high-performance fender is now ready to be delivered and installed at its final destination to protect people, vessels, and port infrastructure. Trust Shibata Fender Team. Your partner for extensive knowledge and unparalleled expertise in rubber production.